The parkland surrounding this 18th century house at Beninborough Hall is home to the jewel of York, the tansy beetle. The bug was once widespread in the UK but is now endangered and only found on the banks of the River Ouse in York and Cambridgeshire. The beetles are dependent on tansy as their sole food and if a clump disappears this can lead to a decline in the number of the insects. Here at the house they're conserving the beetle. Over time because of human development, such as industrialisation, uh, agricultural practices and uh, housing development, and also uh, the invasion of a, a non-native species of plant called the Himalayan balsam. The habitat and the plants have actually uh, been reduced so that the beetle is now isolated in those two locations. But because it's now isolated, it's actually suffering from a number of different threats and one of which is summer flooding which is happening more and more frequently along uh, the river ooze and that can have a, a, a devastating impact on the population and one single event could wipe out the entire population so that's how crucial it is to try and save the species from extinction. A lot of people take ownership of the beetle in York because it is so special and this is one of the only sites you'll find it in the UK. Um, so a lot of people feel responsible for the beetle. And uh, when you obviously go to these people and, and explain what's happening and why it's so rare, a lot of people like to get involved and help out wherever we can. The bugs depend on tansy as their only food in York. And if the plant disappears, so will the beetle. The National Trust work with volunteers at Benningborough Hall to look after the insects and their environment. The tansy plant um, likes this kind of riverbank situation, um, which leads to problems with conservation of it because of overgrazing and industrialisation in these areas. So what we do is we come down and we build the enclosures. Uh, also we grow plants in our nursery in the gardens that we then come and plant out. Also we come down with volunteers mainly but also with some staff and we make sure that the tansy enclosures have tansy in them so we remove the nettles, any Himalayan balsam, overgrowing brambles and things like that so it stays fairly enclosed with tansy really. The Trust host open days to teach the community all about the critter but why is the bug so special? The tansy beetle is an amazing kind of ambassador for York. It's really special for us here. Um, also it's a conservation issue. Um, it has a wonderful history, we don't know what its future is. With the numbers of the tansy beetle increasing by 60% in the city last year, the work of conservationists here has certainly gone some way to protect this jewel in York's crown. Anna Riley, That's TV.